and never return. <laughs> Take your place in the circle of life. Hey, welcome everybody to the Hunt Day Show. Uh, this week <laughs> we are talking uh, Lion King. Uh, the remake, the redo, the reboot, the, live, the, hell the quote unquote live action. Yeah, if that's what you want to go with, whatever the hell this is or this was. <laughs> um, but we are giving our review today. Uh, so be aware there are going to be mad spoilers on this. Um, I mean, I wouldn't even call it spoilers. I mean, true. <laughs> if, if you see the true. original Lion King, I mean, that's very this. true. You've yeah, so. This. You know, we're going to go uh, you know, a little bit in depth, not too much, uh, but give our overview of how we feel about this movie. Now, um, uh, so we're going to start with the negatives. Um, oh, and oh, just, oh, 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 yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. We're gonna, and yeah, I'm, so it's, yeah, go ahead and start it off because, man, I, man. Okay, so I just saw this movie today and I'm ready to dig into it. Yeah, and I think we got a good list of negatives. <laughs> um, what I'm going to start with is the most obvious thing is the music parts right okay. the musical parts you got i'm not i don't have a problem with the voices and the mm -hmm. singing mm -hmm. that to me is it comes across well each each of these singers put their own little twist in the music and it's not bad right it's not it's not the original but it's not bad uh, my problem is the fact that the you know, it's live action. You get these um, parts about th these musical parts, where in the original, you you know, it comes across so well. Yeah. The cartoon, the animation. Yeah. But in this aspect, where it's live action, it's very dry. And to me, that's the worst part of the movie. I I did really like the rest the live action i like the the art style i mean mm -hmm. I, I don't have a problem with it i don't think i think it could have been better yeah but to me that's not the problem to me the problem is these musical parts of the movie come through and you just don't really enjoy I mean, it's all, them it's all too, like it, everything literally if you've seen the animated one you've seen this one like literally and yeah, and it goes it goes beat by beat. Yeah, you know, it's the same damn thing. New. Like honestly, for me, there's oh, some God. jokes, you know that. Like this movie, uh, okay. Like honestly, I, I went into this movie not thinking much of it. Like okay, have you seen Lion King before? You've seen this already, and uh, not even halfway into the movie, I was falling asleep. <laughs> I was like, I already know what happens. I already know what's gonna happen, and yeah. I'm like like okay all right whatever but you know what speaking of the animation this whole quote-unquote live action that's why i said live action with the quotes in there because this entire fucking movie is nothing but animation like none of these creatures none CG, of these animals yeah. there are real none of them they're all animated i'm like no get the f out of here with that like this is just what you thought this, there were gonna be real animals in this shit put some no real way. animals in there i mean what you, are you talking you, about it's supposed it's to like be live animal. action right like give me some real animals i mean not all the animals in the movie were even talking so you like it's for the ones that are not even like talking or have anything like going on really in the main storyline like give me some real animals but nothing was real in this movie nothing oh, no and one then, expected real animals and then on top of that okay on Train top of that zebras. Yeah. <laughs> on top of that like you have these whole like just deadpan animations on their faces like yeah. when fucking simba was like like dad 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 you're dead like it was just like like nothing just like oh my dad's dead oh no uh and then here comes scar oh look you killed your dad well i guess you gotta get out of here now like it, it, oh my god that, that whole scene i was just like oh my god they kind of ruined it but on top of that 
the voice actor for Scar, I hated him. He was he was boring. He wasn't scary. He wasn't menacing. He wasn't anybody to like to be like, oh fuck, like now we gotta listen to this guy. Like honestly, like oh no, they they should have just brought back the original actor who who voiced Scar for me. But uh, what else you got? Um, yeah, I mean, to me, that was the biggest problem with just the musical parts of the movie. Mm -hmm. You're right. Some of these, like, close-up on faces just didn't work. They the did. fact that they went live action and CG, it just, just didn't work with the characters' personalities coming through. Nala, to me, was, like, one of the worst characters. Like, <laughs> it just did not come across... And I mean, maybe the voice acting was decent, but the, just the uh, Beyonce's she, or, or the little kid one. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> uh, no, the, the Beyonce's. Um, <laughs> like, Nala one, yeah. straight up came across as like, just not sh like no fit. She looked just like the rest of the tribe. The, yeah. The, yeah, the, the tribe. And there was nothing like individualistic about. Yeah, I was these like, facial I was like, performances. Okay, you're gonna do this yeah. whole thing where the the animals are gonna be talking. So you have the lip movement, you have them speaking, but then you have their eyes and they're like the rest of their features is deadpan. Like I don't understand what was the idea behind that. Like why why just have them actually talk and move their mouths, and then just to have their like the rest of their face to just look like nothing like nothing was bothering them yeah like i thought no that was kinda, oh yeah yeah and and then also they yeah it was just the, um, <laughs> the, the musical parts like i was in for the rest of the movie yes i know what's gonna happen mm -hmm. but once some music started playing you just kind of lose interest <laughs> it's the volume was like set kind of low too so you're like I don't know if that was just a theater I was watching. Or that's something that's. Um, uh, I think for me, the music, I mean, the volume and everything was fine. I mean, but there were some parts where, like, uh, let's see, what song was kind of like sticking out like a sore of thumb? Uh, I think mostly, mo probably the ones before they grew up. Because the, the one where, like, uh, Nala finds Simba, like, I you can you can hear Beyonce try harding on that song. I was like, okay, here, you know. No, and I, I like it's I said, I kind of did like <laughs> the twist that they did put. I'm glad it wasn't just them repeating verse by verse. Like, yeah, it was verse by verse, but they 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 put their own flavor into it. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, man, I mean, it, it <laughs> not a lot of personality in the movie because of the live action. Yeah, it, you know, like looking at it, you know that this isn't the solution for Disney, like. This isn't gonna be what you're like. You, they thought. Look, let's CG all our mo old movies. We're mm -hmm. gonna make a killing. Mm -hmm. It's gonna be easy money. Mm -hmm. It's not the case anymore, man. It's not. It's not like Lion King just shows. Yeah, you can live action everything. You can put the mm -hmm. best actors you can you want on there. Mm -hmm. It's not enough, man. Like that. That's not enough to for to convince someone to pay 20 bucks for a ticket and, <laughs> and you know yeah um uh, yeah. yeah and we'll so let's go to the positives yeah i was about we, to say we like, well, what did you like i mean I, my shit is limited i don't know what you have <laughs> oh I, I like the comedy uh they okay. did different jokes than the original had mm -hmm. although they did leave some of the original jokes mm -hmm. they did implement some of the new ones and i really liked Seth Rogen, I like uh, uh, Eisner, I believe is his ass name. Yeah, Billy uh, Eisner, yeah. That's the, the uh, yeah, and then uh, Saz Sazu was, uh, uh, what's his John name? John Oliver. Uh, yeah, John Oliver. Actually, I really at, liked... first, at first when they when, when you that you get it reintroduced to Sazu, and as soon as I hear John Oliver's voice, I was like, oh, man, I can't imagine anybody else but John's face. Like, it was on that bird, I was just like, oh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I don't know, for me, it was hard to, like, picture, like, the bird and not John's face. But anyways, go I on, sorry. <laughs> no, and I, I mean, I get that, but I really mm -hmm. liked their interpretations of it. Uh, it was, I think they was, they were pretty funny. Mm -hmm. uh, I did think that, um, that, uh, 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 <laughs> freaking, uh, the kid, what's his name? Uh, the young Simba? Uh, yeah, Simba. I liked how Simba 
Uh, oh. His name is JD McCurry. McCurry? Something like okay, that. Okay. And uh, freaking, uh, <laughs> what's his name? Did Simba? Oh, the adult Simba was Donald Glover. Okay, okay. okay. Chad was no, oh, yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah, I really liked how their interpretation of him. I think they were good at voice acting. Like, I, I don't have a problem with the voice yeah. acting of the, of the okay. movie. Uh, so I do like the voice acting. Mm -hmm. I think it was a little bit overplayed because these guys, I mean, they're basically just doing a, a redo. Okay. Right, yeah. they're just doing the same lines that have already been put out there. It's not hard to do them again. Yeah, I mean, like I said, I mean, this movie was basically like nothing really different from the animated version. I mean, uh, I don't think anybody was expecting anything different. If honestly, it's just for the new generation to watch. I mean, that's what it felt yeah, like. Yeah, true. It's just an introduction for the new generation. I do like some of the shots that they had out there, uh, they were pretty legit. Um, uh you know some of the cg was really good looking um but for the most part yeah pretty bland movie is what kind of like was. it I felt mean, like, I said, I, like I, pretty I, average I movie is kind of like what it felt like to me in the end um no you want to give you, our uh, yeah, anything I, else you well, like? i can tell you for sure what i did like was uh if we're going to talk about the animation itself i did like the animation whenever you see them uh in the nighttime whenever it's dark because whenever it's dark or whatever, it's easier for the animators to like make them look realer than it is in the daytime. And you could tell the difference, like from the day and night cycles they had. Like whenever they're in the daytime, you could kind of see like uh, it doesn't really look 100% real, but more towards like whenever it's in the night, you're like, oh, okay, now it looks like legit. Looks like that's real line or whatever. But um, yeah, I did like uh, Simba's adult uh, 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 design, I guess you can call it, his, his animation. Uh, what else did I like? Uh, mm, I like how whenever they did fight Scar, like uh, towards the end already, uh, it wasn't so much like... Uh, uh, it, it wasn't so much like a uh, cartoony like it was in the animated version where you know that the uh, Rafiki I think is the name of that monkey who comes down and starts kicking everybody's ass with his, yeah. his staff whatever and this yeah, one yeah. it felt more like realistic in, ter in that term so I was like okay that's cool you know they changed that up a little bit I like the hyenas man the hyenas I think were really well portrayed they were mm -hmm. menacing uh, I, I really liked them. Uh, their designs, the voice acting, mm -hmm. whoever the hell was voice acting them. I, I like them as, uh, <laughs> as enemies. All right. Well, if you want to go ahead and we can just go ahead and give our final score on this. So, like I said before, I mean, it's a pretty average movie. It it's really not is. bad, but it's not good and very much good. It's not mm -hmm. great. Um, I would not like we reviewed a couple of movies in this channel already and and mm -hmm. to be fair to be honest like most of them i've been you know i thought were worth going to the movies and having that experience this is one of those movies where i can't recommend that <laughs> i can't i can't recommend with a wholeheartedly yeah and tell you hey you you go pay the you know yeah, whatever, whatever. 15, amount of 60, dollars to go watch yeah, this movie in theaters to go yeah, watch this it. movie in theaters i can't i can't do it like wait it out it's gonna be on disney plus you can have it oh, in your, yeah. your subscription true. service at the end of the year you know and just kind of watch it that way yeah. i don't think you know it, it is has a bit of nostalgia for us old timers that you know grew <laughs> up on this yeah so it does have that like yeah it brings back a bit of nostalgia but yeah, I did have somebody in my yeah. theater like who was sitting next to me. Like whenever the songs kicked on, like she was all in it. She was like, "Oh, yeah. I remember that song? Oh my god!" <laughs> yeah, but I was just like, oh, "Okay." That, that's really what carries those songs yeah. is the nostalgia. Because mm -hmm. if you're just watching this and trying to gain some inspiration from those scenes, there's really none to be found. I mean, it's pretty bland. There were, I mean, this, like I said, Simone, the Simone and uh, Akuna Matata, I think was pretty good mm -hmm. um the the one that you mentioned where it's uh, nala and simba when they see each other again yeah, was so bland yeah. like uh love is in the air tonight whatever the hell it's called uh, um, yeah, 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 that's right. um it's you know you're trying to portray love and it just comes across not as as it should right I, or yeah, as the I cartoons think, did you don't see that, that is that we, because it came from the animated version like everything is pretty much shot for shot like in the animated version it was kind of rushed it was really fast so there was really mm -hmm. not much development there 
so uh, nowadays i think we're more used to like having these movies be a little bit more a like, little uh, better uh, arc yeah a little yeah, better an arc and and it's not it's not as 90s as it used to be where uh, see there's you there's jumps in time and you just you're just expecting you're to be like, like oh they're in love now so love at first sight yeah yeah i get it i get it yeah. i get it uh, but, but yeah, what, what would you I, rate it? I, I'm gonna give it a 6.0, just above, you know, average. Like oh, okay. it, it's okay. it's a little better than average. I'm gonna yeah. give it a 6.0. Do I recommend you go spend money on this? No, Absolutely. just wait it out and uh, <laughs> you know, rent it, red box it, or Disney Plus it, whatever. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'm right around there too. I'm like five out of ten in this movie. Uh, okay. Skip it. Don't watch it in theaters. Just watch the animated version. It's way better. To yeah. Be honest. Uh, yeah. And then you can blow up the music parts and you know mm. do do all that. And yeah, I get it. 5.0 seems pretty fair. Right? <laughs> but yeah, that's it. I mean, yeah, guys, don't go watch this movie. Disappointed. <laughs> I'm disappointed because you know uh, Disney. Yeah. You know, and, and it kind of. I understand now, you know, with Mulan coming out, how they said that mm -hmm. it's not going to be beat by beat. It's not going to be mm -hmm. there. I don't even think they're going to put the music in there. They're really just kind of rebooting it and create it, this movie makes me more excited for that. Oh, I don't know. There's going to be I'm more creative. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, no, uh, it's good. But I like the fact that they're just going to have that creative freedom to create their own live action Mulan instead of just doing what Lion yeah. King did and just doing scene by scene and doing that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm disappointed. Disappointed. All right, then. <laughs> All right, then. Well, I guess that's it, right? I mean, you want to close this out? <laughs> yeah, well, uh, guys, let us know what <laughs> you guys thought. Uh, are we wrong? Yeah, I definitely want to hear is other people thought about Is it just as good as the original? Is it better? Uh, is it trash? Let us know. Tell us what your score is down at the bottom. Like, comment, share uh yeah and uh thank you for watching we'll be back mm -hmm. next week uh yeah next week i don't even I know have no idea. <laughs> Peace. all right later guys